about to be a family reunion. Uh oh, family reunion. Come on, family reunion. My song, family reunion. All day long. Now, when I was little, I broke both my arms when I was about the age of three or four. Did I fix mine? Same time. How? It happened. The first time I broke my arm, it was after seeing The Little Mermaid, and we were in our above ground pool, my mom and I, and she said, hold on to the side while I clean out oh, the boy. pool. Three or four. When The Little Mermaid came out? I remember more like five, because I remember the pictures, five or six. You were five. Yeah, Chelsea Anyways. was around, so I was probably five. Yeah, I was around. The Little Mermaid in high school. Anyway. Uh, Anyways, um, so she said, I held on to the side of the pool, and I was like, okay. So I was trying, you know, the scene where she goes, part of the world. And the water goes, and the water goes behind her, and she's up on the rock. And, uh, so I was doing I that scene over and over, but I wasn't getting enough splash <laughs> behind me, like in the movie. So I was kicking my legs forward to splash, and I kicked myself out of the pool and I fell three feet and broke my arm. Like a little fracture break like in the middle of this arm. So then I have a cast. But my cast is a Snoopy cast. Can I spin your eye? Oh. Um, my cast is a Snoopy cast. Isn't that cool? With penis. So then I got my cast sawed off and a week later Pocahontas thing? No. Then a week, literally a week later, I was, um, mom was brushing my teeth, and I was sitting on the counter. What? She's helping me brush How my teeth. How Like five. We were doing the teeth brushing thing. She helped me. I just Still. <laughs> Whatever. And... So the phone rings and I'm sitting on the counter and she says, okay, just sit there. I have to get the phone. Don't move. And I was like, okay. So I was sitting there. But, um, I wanted to dance. <laughs> so I got up and was dancing in the mirror on the counter and I fell and I broke my other arm in the exact same place. So, concert lineup. Um, Abby gets to go to see a, quite a few concerts this uh, upcoming few months, and I get to see some as well. Abby, what are yours? Well, you miss I'm, them. I'm going to see Andrew Bird later this month, and then I'm going. What? Where is that? Is that the Crystal Ballroom? I do not know. I've never been okay. to a show in Portland before. Well, you only got for it this next couple months. Yep. Okay. Um, then and then know. I'm gonna go see. Uh, Fleet Foxes. And who is opening for them? Blitz and Trapper. Fabulous. It's gonna be awesome. They're actually from Eugene originally. Yeah, they're from the Northwest. I think I knew that. And Fleet Foxes from are Oregon. from Seattle, huh? I think. I think they're from Seattle. So that will be cool. And then I'm going to see if, I don't know, we'll see how it goes with work. I'm sure Later she will that go week, see. there's Dr. Dog. And I think the cave singers are opening for them. That should be awesome. So I want to try and go to that one too. And then in May, I'm going to go see the Avid Brothers. Very cool. And hopefully Chelsea's going to go to that too. I want her to. I am going to see Bryce. That would be cool. In the end of May. And you're going to see that cute guy that you were talking about, Pup Pep. Tepe. Tepe. It's, it's not like, the, here's the thing, I can't be attracted to musicians that I respect. Does that make sense? No. Because there's a lot of really attractive ones, but I don't think of them as sex objects. It's more, like people think of Brad Pitt as like, you know, this like icon okay. for the ideal male or whatever, like everyone okay. thinks Brad Pitt is hot. I don't do that with musicians. I like think they're attractive in a respective way, but I can't help just being in awe. You just respect the music. 
I respect the music. <laughs> and then after thrice, um, no doubt tour with Fairmore. That's gonna be so much fun. And that's in San Francisco? Or San Diego. I don't know where it is. Oh. Or where it is. Maybe it's Sacramento. Maybe it's Sacramento. Started growing a beard and we like it. Conchos. Yes. Conchero. Yes. Yes. 